family surprise, welcome back to the channel guys. this a uh, video that you're seeing at the moment so um, I put a video out a couple of days ago um, and I just wanted to do so the second half of the video and share with you a surprise that I find um, in the garden so let's go uh, vegetable I think it's a vegetable that I'm gonna show you and um, I'm excited about it I'm so excited about this that I'm gonna show you guys because I wasn't sure what it was guys so I have this Look at this right here. Maybe somebody could tell me before I even show it to you. Look at this flower, guys. Look at this flower right here. And you tell me in the comment section what it is. What type of flower do you think that is, guys? What do you think this flower look like? I wasn't quite sure because I thought I planted something different and something else came. So look at the flowers, guys, and tell me what you think that flowers is and look at this little small one right here and you tell me what that is look at the bottom of it so i'm gonna show you what i've discovered in the garden i thought i planted something else and something else came okay so here we go guys look look at this right here look at this i'm gonna lower this camera so you can see what i'm showing you yeah you should be able to see so all right guys so here we go look at this right here guys look at this right here i am thinking that this was a i thought this was maybe a um a bitter melon because i thought i planted bitter melon but if you guys remember um i talked about getting some seeds from homestead heart and which was just amazing and um i'm so grateful that she was able to do that for us but i'm um, looking at this plant right here guys i just discovered that this plant is not a bitter melon it's a loofah it's a loofah guys <laughs> yeah so i have loofah growing in my garden i'm so excited guys that this is the first time i've a loofah in my life this is the first time i've seen it um i bought the sponge online and stuff like that but i did not know that that's what uh the sponge came from that it comes from this type of plant so i'm gonna leave this and let it mature because i don't think that it's ready yet um, from my research i think it has to be kind of yellow and a little brown before it's um before you can actually um uh harvest it so i'm gonna keep let you guys give you an update on this when it's time for it to harvest and i will have a sponge so i think next year guys i'm gonna put some more um of this stuff in the garden and see how it does i did not know guys that this is loofah and i've heard homestead heart talk so much about loofah <laughs> so i am experiencing loofah so this is my one loofah here and I think I have a small one that I showed you guys a minute ago over there. So we'll see how that turns out and I'll keep you updated and share it with you. So hopefully you can see. You see how big it is guys? It's huge. Look how big this is. It's really big guys. It's a big, big plant. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited. Look at that. It is amazing. So yeah guys. So I have loofah right there growing. And I'm excited about sharing it with you guys and I'll share how it turns out and I'll, you know, open it and everything just to share it, show, you, show you guys how it turns out, okay? There's still a bell pepper I have growing right here. I'm going to leave it and let it mature some more. And all the tomatoes are now um, disappeared. No more tomatoes. I have a um, bell pepper here. Right here I have a bell pepper. Um, I think I'm going to leave this and let it get a little bit more. I believe it's going to get more orange. I'm not sure what type, what variety these are. But I'm going to um, do my more research, guys, as I grow my garden. So I can share a little bit more with you guys. And share the different variety of things. And the name and so forth. And I'm sharing with you guys as I experience and learn along with you guys. So I still have a few more bell pepper here as well 
right here so i'm gonna leave these and let them do their thing and then i'll come back and get that so to clean up see i have lots of weed growing right now that i'm gonna come and clean it up and get this ready for you know maybe next year i don't think i'm gonna plant anything for the fall if i do i will share that with you guys okay i still have some more okra over there that i need to um go ahead and pick and so i can have those to plant for my next next year so this is the next loofah that's growing right here i don't know if there's any more that's gonna grow but this is the next one right here and i have some uh, flowering that's happening and so we'll see if there are any if i have any more loofah that comes out i will share it with you guys there you have it guys um well my watermelon patch the watermelon didn't do so good but i have a few um just some small ones that came out and i will share that in the video with you guys i will put that um in the clips of the video i'll put the rest of stuff with it all right so guys i think that will do it for today i just wanted to kind of give you an update of you know what happened and what the progress was of the garden and, and how it turned out as you can see you know some things came out some things did good like the tomatoes i showed you early on in the in the um in the um in the garden those did pretty good the tomatoes did good i have good peppers that came out and um of course a kalaloo did pretty good and um as i shared earlier the potatoes i'm still waiting to see what's gonna come out of these sweet potatoes because i have the japanese potatoes here and i have the regular potatoes so which is the orange one so i will share when i when those um grow and mature i will come back and pick those and then i'll share what i get from it okay so i think that's it so oh look at that guys as i'm getting ready to wrap this video up look what i see i see some um i'm not sure if this is gonna even mature because these look like some um lemon or they're orange or something no oh oh my goodness guys before i finish the video let me show you guys something real quick I forgot that I need to show you guys the persimmon, how much they have grown. My persimmon has grown so much and I almost finished the video without showing you guys what they're looking like. They've grown so much and they look really good. So, um, I hate those spider web. They always getting me. So let me show you guys my, our persimmon tree has grown so much and uh, they look really good so let's see if i can show you guys them before i finish the video look guys oh look at that look at the persimmon yeah so this is this is how much the persimmon has grown guys oh my goodness look at that this is so beautiful look at that it's not quite ready they're turning color but they're not ready so i have one and i have some more growing on in here look at that I have a quite a few under here this is about four or so under here guys under this bunch it's a big bunch so and there's some more over here look at that oh my goodness this is one of my favorite favorite fruit guys this is one of my favorite fruit my number one fruit actually in america this is my favorite 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 fruit because it definitely reminds me of um, another fruit from Jamaica. There's a apple in Jamaica that they call star apple. And it reminds me of that. So I have about 11 on this tree, I believe. There's another one under here. See, there's one more there. So we have about 11 of these uh, um, persimmon on this tree. Look at this. <clears throat> excuse me there's another two right there and they're growing nicely guys look at that they're coming in really really nice they're so beautiful look at this one right here yeah guys so that's the this is how this tree is doing and this tree right now um this is the second year that uh, we planted this is uh two years now since we planted this tree and the first year last year we got uh, i think we got about one we got one one uh 
a one or two i believe we got from this tree last year and now we have um almost a dozen uh persimmon on this tree so plant your fruit trees guys soon as you get on that property go ahead and plant your fruit tree because you know you have to give it time to grow and it may take you i'm surprised this is giving us fruits already but we've had a uh, apple tree that's over there and it's been four years or three years i believe that is planted and we haven't gotten anything from that tree yet so and i believe they said you may have to wait five years to get apples from that tree and i also have a pear tree at the top so we'll see how long that takes for us to um, get fruits from but as you can see this is really progressing really nice and i'm so grateful and happy that this is growing nice because that's my favorite fruit <laughs> all right guys so that will do it for today i hope that you guys enjoy the video if you do guys please go ahead and give us a thumbs up on this video don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified when we put on our next video and i will see you guys in the next one walk good be safe and stay in your purpose okay bye guys <laughs>